Hi, my name is Kumar Indran. I'm 26 years old from Penang. I've been training for martial art for more than five years. I watch a lot of Mom Ali and uh, Mike Texan. So when I see Mike Texan fight, it gave me more an obsession of want to learn how to fight. So basically, I learned from home first. I usually have a small punching bag at home. I train myself, and then my friend suggested me let's go to RCS, and then I came, and here I am for five years already. My coach Vincent. He's the one who asked me to compete. I didn't know how to go and compete first of all. I just, basically I just come to learn the techniques and just want to train. One day, Vincent said that, uh, Kuma, do you want to compete? And I was like, oh, okay, let's go. And then, yeah, he keep calling me. So he said I have potential to fight. So here I am until now, keep fighting. I MMA mean, I've been doing for one year. So my coach suggested me that because all the time going for kickboxing. So my coach Wilson told me that uh, let's try for MMA. Why have to stuck in one place, kickboxing or boxing, rather go to MMA. Let's have a different kind of feel. Then I was thinking that, yeah, why not, right? It's going to be a different kind of experience and different kind of level compared to kickboxing, boxing and Muay Thai. MMA is going to be more different kind of feeling. So I was thinking that, yeah, let's go, let's give a try. and. Yeah, here I am. Training is is very exhausted, to be honest. It's good to be exhausted. Doing the fight, my exhausted is worse. Doing the training is exhausted is fine. Because it's training, right? I have to train very hard. But in my, in my MMA debut, I don't have much experience. It just ended in the first round, and I don't have fully experience. It been, I got been taken down in the fight, but not fully ground and pound, you know, that kind of feeling. I don't have that experience yet, so I can't give a proper answer for that. <laughs> the level of intensity compared to MMA, kickboxing, MMA is huge. It's all weight distribution. You're going to, you're going to carry a person weight and, you know, slam down and everything. Kickboxing is much better, but MMA is <laughs> it's, it's fun, but it's going to be very exhausted. <laughs> I'll go crazy, right? So, <laughs> people will say uh, I'm very humble, very kind. But when it comes to enter the ring, I'm a different kind of person. So, <laughs> I like that kind of person. I, I like another version of me where I slam people, no mercy. I like to see the people's fear in their eyes. <laughs> so, I like to slam people. And at the same time, I like the feel of the pain. Oh, I feel hurt, or I feel, oh, give me the pain, all right, I give you more. That kind of feeling, you know, that kind of thing. So, <laughs> I, I like that. My personal goal at MMA is, of course, everyone want to have a title. I want to be recognized to all the fighters all over Malaysia, or maybe all over the country. I want to be more recognized. That's what my motive, and I want to let those future fighters that, oh, there's a guy named Kumar, who's a fighter, oh, he's technical. How his technique, how his, how people describe me as an idol, that kind of thing. Let them know, let the next generation, next fighter know how's my technique and everything. <laughs>